السلام علیکم ڈیئر ویورس یو ویلکم ٹو مائی مینٹو یوٹیوب چینل آئی ہوپ یو آل آر فائن الانگ ود یور فیملی ممبرس آئی ایم میکنگ دس ویڈیو ٹو آل دوز پیرنٹس اینڈ گارڈینس ہو وانٹ ڈیئر وارڈس ٹو اسٹڈی فار کمپٹیٹیو ایگزامس لائک کے ایس آئی ایس اینڈ ادر ایس ایس سی لیول ایگزامس One thing uh, every parent or a guardian must keep into mind is that if they are planning to make their ward case or IES officer in future, inshallah, they should do one thing. They have to create an environment uh, in their families from very younger age to their students that you see, you have to prepare for this exam. Uh, you need to go through newspapers, you have to listen to the n- news. They should approach to anyone from their area who has qualified KS, who has qualified IS exam. Sometimes take your ward, take your student to him, he will meet him. A dream will uh, get ignited in his mind. Yeah, I too want to be like him. He will share some of the important inputs with your ward, uh, with your son, with your daughter. That will have an impact on your ward's mind. So that way, he will always try his best at the school, in the college, that I too want to be a KS officer or I too want to be an IS officer. Uh, and I think the best thing for our students is that they should prepare for these exams at very young, early age. Uh, if they will start coaching for IS or KS exam during their graduation, uh, when they are in their first year, second year or in final year, Uh, that will help them a lot. Um, most of the students first go for masters. That means the prime time, 21, 22, 23, that all energy goes into his master's subject. And that is of no use in civil service exam. So that is the best thing they can do. So start preparing during your graduation. And even after your graduation, you don't need to go for masters on regular mode. You can do masters in the subject which is your optional from IGNO mode as well. And better would be if somebody has done B.Tech and he starts preparing for case exam just after his graduation. So that student has much chances to qualify these exams because syllabus is very much vast, it is broad. So it takes one and a half year for every student to prepare that. And when the student has already done masters, most of his energy has went in the subject. That has no importance here. So it becomes very much difficult for him to give competition to the students who have done it who have started from graduation or who are doing it after their B.Tech. So, that is one thing that is very important. And the other thing is the support of the family. This exam needs too much effort. Uh, we cannot say whosoever appears for this exam, he will become KS or IS officer. So, almost 98 to 99 percent students usually face failure. There is just one person that has to be an officer. So that thing, has, that thing has to be kept in the mind of the student earlier when he starts preparing that chances of being an KS or IS officer are really less in this exam. So he should not get disheartened after his first or second attempt. So he has to come with this mind, it's very much difficult. But one thing is there, if he prepares for this exam, it will shape his personality. He will not be same the way he was during his graduation. He will not be same the way he was during his uh, masters or after his masters. So that thing is very important that it will chisel his personality. He will be a different person after going through NCRT books, after standing, sitting in this exam, preparing for it honestly, uh, his own environment, his own friend circle and his perception of looking at the things, he will think differently than others. So those are some of the positives which will come to him. Uh, I am here, you can all anytime text me for your guidance for KS or IS exam. I teach KS and IS aspirants, I guide them. So our best wishes are always with you. May Allah bless you all. See you in my next video. Till then, take care. Bye. Allah Hafiz.